Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since I've been in the office or should I say it's been a while since I've made a small business video. So I've received an order for my culprit mugs and I'm going to package them today. Also, I'm going to make some sticker labels like thank you cards and thank you stickers using the Mundin label printer. So these are my thank you cards to stick on the boxes right there. So I'm just going to keep them in that little bin there. You know I DIY them all the time. I've got videos on my channel on how I do them step by step. So if you want to learn how I do that, go and watch those. I'll also link them in the description below so you've got easy access and no excuses. Because I've bought these from Primark, I usually print my business card when I get orders but today I want to make life easier for myself so I'm gonna print them in batches I'm gonna print about 10 or 20 I use the label sticker as well and then I would stick them on card stocks so it has that depth it has that you know that thank you sticker card feel rather than do it like this with these cups I package them in these boxes so I don't have to make the card stock I can just print them on this and then I'm gonna paste them here I'll include a picture here because I've done some before and I post them on my TikTok I just love 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 my packaging for these mugs so this order I received it from TikTok shop last month I received some from TikTok shop but because I was moving I had to cancel them, which is annoying, I know. Yeah, I just received this sale two days ago. I'm in a different city now. I don't even know where I'm gonna send it. Like, where, I don't know where the post office is or any every drop-off shops. So I need to know where they, those are. Okay, so this is how my thank you card is gonna be for boxes. Anything else, I'll just put them on a card and put them in the package. But for now, this is just so fun. They just need to scratch that off to reveal the, th the code that they're gonna get. So now I'm going to package this cup and a coaster. So whenever I got a delivery from Amazon, I always keep the packaging. So these are all recycled packaging from Amazon that I'm going to use to package my cups and stuff like that. So these are all bubble wrap and paper and cardboard like this. Even though I want to be um, eco-friendly and environmental friendly, I still have to take into consideration because um, I don't want the cups to be broken. So. Sometimes I have to bear, break the rule just a bit just so that they don't get broken and because I want to use this up as well so I'm glad that I kept this um, yeah, so I'm going to use this so I'm just going to touch back on the thank yous card I had one that I love but it got deleted 30 minutes ago I sat here and I made a new thank you card template 
So I thought I should give you guys a little tour of the office space that's going on in my living room. So my living space is behind me. So I have to make things work at the moment. So this is my office station and I got this pegboard from Ikea. I put it up using Velcro and it stays up good. I'm liking it. Things on it are not too heavy. So this is very functional for me and I like how it's set up. I can never really find my scissors, so I'm glad that I could be able to hang them up. If I got something that is more important, I'll hang them up. But for now, we're going to leave the scissors is there. Um, I got my thank you cards up here. This thank you card will be for my brand. And I'll elaborate on that more. My clothing brand. This one now, I'm going to need this to use um, when I'm packaging this order. I've got my fragile tapes here. I also got these small one from Timu and some more thank you. Thank you sticker. This thank you sticker. Let me show you guys. I got this thank you sticker from Timu and I plan to use them on Valentine's Day. So I bought those way in advance. You guys saw me using this just now. This is like a scratch sticker that the customer can scratch to reveal what discount they get. These are my tissue paper, these brown, dark brown, tan, tan color. Um, so they'll go in this box as well. I like these neutral tone colors. When I'm packaging these mugs, so I love this. So you're gonna see how I do those. Sometimes I put them on, sometimes I don't. I got them from Amazon. Here again, I got these honeycomb. This is a honeycomb. This is my last one that I got from Timo. I might have to stock up on this. I usually use it in my packaging. You're gonna see me use that as well. This now, this is what I use whenever I am making these. So if you if you use like cups or bottles, this is essential. I think I got this from, I can link the one from Amazon as well on this. These are the Cricut vinyls that I've been using. So I put the one that I use most here and the other ones around that section here. I bought some stickers that I want to incorporate in my packaging. I love greeneries, I love plants. So that's why I put these in it. So, so right now I'll just unpack them and put them in, take them out of the packaging because it will be easier for me to see them. So if I should do that, and they'll fit much better inside. I think I'll leave this one out. It's a good day for you, still shine. You can get these stickers off Timo. Timo sell a lot of stickers that you can incorporate in your packaging. And I would recommend if you want to spruce up your packaging, let it look be a bit more fun, you can do that. These, we've got some pink ones here. I don't usually go for pink, but it depends on what I'm selling. So each sticker really correlates with what item they buy. Lovely, lovely. I'm just going to. I'm gonna keep this in this one in the packaging for now. In here. So what I love with this is that you just need to slide it in like that. You don't have to take it out. You just slide it through here. I really i'm really glad that i have this this is some this is an essential that i use when i'm making my thank you cards i usually can't find it so i usually put them here these are my stamps um sometimes i got other stamps as well i haven't been using these for a while but they're lovely down here now we've got our um care labels our thank you card right here i got these bins from primark lovely one pound fifty for the small one and this big one is for three pounds this one have all a lot of stuff so the vinyl that i pre-made there in this jar from ikea 
um, Ikea jar as well. This alcohol I need it for my things and in here I just keep my thermal labels. Here I keep some of my clothing. This is a all-in-one small business studio as well as my work from home office because you guys know I do have a nine to five as well and I try to business on the side because it's something that I love if you're trying to start a business try doing something that you love in that case you won't it won't feel like a chore you just want to get up and you look forward to do it every day so this thing that I'm doing it's like that so that's why I keep going even sometimes when I don't get any sales I'm not that disheartened because it's really something that I enjoy doing. What I was saying earlier is that because I moved from London, I do not know where the post office is or where the every drop-off shops are. So tomorrow I'll have to do that. I don't know how I haven't done that and I have a small business. Like how unprofessional of me to not try to locate where those areas are but that's because I closed the business or I put my shop on holiday mode so I can move as you all know that I've just moved into my first apartment and I've been doing some moving vlogs DIY vlogs home decor vlogs that I'm incorporating in this channel I hope you guys are enjoying that journey that I'm on right now I just love 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 interior designing anything has to do with decor stuff like that i go to ikea primax let me contain myself because i'll go on a tangent so now let's package these. this is my box of recycled recycled paper whenever i order something from amazon i keep them and you should too so that you can use it in your packaging so i'm gonna shoot for a tiktok so i want this plant here just for some, you know, some background so it looks good and things like that. So let's go get packaging. First, I'm gonna ensure that I put a cushion here. So I'm gonna use this. because I want the sides to fold up. We've got our box there. I'm gonna stuff it with our paper. I usually get this wipe with my oven. Put it in. In. I usually take this and I place it on top.
Thank you so much for watching and as always I'll see you on the next one. Bye!